Next, a Nottinghamshire charity which has been supporting vulnerable people at home during the pandemic is now helping those feeling anxious as lockdown restrictions begin to ease, as Giles Taylor reports. This colourful vehicle has been a lifeline for some during the lockdown. Now, volunteers at the Rosie May Foundation are helping those same people to feel safe as restrictions are gradually lifted. So our new initiative as we ease out of lockdown is to try and help people that have anxiety about returning to what the new normal is going to be. Our volunteers in the community bake some lovely cupcakes and we turn up to um, an isolated person and have a chat just to help them um, ease out and uh, reduce anxieties and reduce, of course, loneliness. The foundation was set up in the name of Mary's daughter, who was tragically murdered almost 20 years ago. The foundation now has 12 volunteers carrying out visits five days a week to people like Christine. It's something to look forward to. You get up each morning, they're all seeing the same. Then Friday, Friday you think, oh, I'm getting fish and chips today. <laughs> Mary is now planning to buy two more tuk-tuks, in pink, of course, to expand the scheme.